What's going on, everybody? Team Tune Rose, and we're bringing you guys a new series today. Me and Jack have kind of figured, hey, let's do something fun. On uh, me, but my draws are not saving me. Because, like, all right, let's duel. Training wheels completely off. You're going down a hill at 98 miles per hour. Let's duel. Like, what? <laughs> <laughs> what the hell is this? All right, hop on your motorcycle. My what? <laughs> my, my, hmm? Yep, I lose. <laughs> I, 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 I feel like you're supposed to lose. At least that's what I'm telling myself. <laughs> well, that's, well, that's what I'm telling myself. So Jack had the great idea, let's play Rush Duels. And I've never looked anything up on this game, so I'm completely blind to it. He's completely blind to it, so we're going in blind. Ain't that right, buddy? <laughs> Yo, know, I have seen nothing. I do know uh, a great friend who's talked about it, um, but he only mentioned it a few times. But, uh, yeah, I, uh, I know nothing. We saw the game was on sale, and we said, you know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. So welcome to Team Toon Rose Plays Yu-Gi-Oh! Rush Duel Dawn of the Battle Royale. All right, just so everybody knows, we are playing this game together. I am playing it on my Switch. Jack is playing it on his Switch. That way we gotta get the, you know, get a good element for, you know, get a good feeling for things, because we're both going into this blind, like we said. Um, this is gonna be, uh, a, a, this is gonna be a little bit of a weird Let's Play, um, because we don't really do you Let's Plays, so. <laughs> I mean, you know what, this is the first time, maybe we might see more. True, true. Now, I will say this, I'll say this. When, uh, the only thing I knew about this was from what Jack told me, and he said this was an actual, like, campaign game. And I was like, oh, that's actually kind of cool. Because I see in Rush Duels, I was like, oh, it's just Duel Links. Like, that's exactly, that's, that was my first thought. I was like, it's just Duel Links. I'm not going to play it. But then when he was like, no, it's, you know, it's supposed to be like a campaign ca type of game. I'm like, oh, well, that changes things. <laughs> yeah, and I saw, like, a, in the thing, it looks like it has, uh, it takes place, like, I guess... I guess from what we're seeing right now off of your screen, it looks like uh, there's the main character from Sevens talking to, I guess, our character. <laughs> yeah, it, yeah. Say like we have our like we have our own character and everything. It's like, why couldn't Yu-Gi-Oh do this so long ago? <laughs> like with a better. Genre. Where's my Yu-Gi-Oh Xenoverse? Right, where? Ex yeah, there you go. Like that would be so good. Ah, oh, that would be really good. You could duel whoever you want. Like, like take dual, like take dual links, because like, like take dual links and just make it a game like this, like, like but better. Dual links, or even just Legacy of the Duelist, like make it like this style of game. Yeah. You you make your own character. You go through all the you know all the series. You meet all the protagonists and stuff like that. Like come on. Yeah, you duel alongside you know you duel alongside them, help them prevent their you know prevent their uh, catastrophes from happening. I was like that. Would, I feel like that would be really good for five Ds because I feel like for like world ending stuff, I feel like five Ds was pretty good. I feel I yeah, I, I agree with everything. I think with every, everything we just said, I really agreed to it. So uh, uh, so Konami, if you're watching, <laughs> if you guys decide to make that game, we'll take our you know we'll take our pay cut. <laughs> I'll say I've only watched like the first two episodes of the Sevens anime. So oh, I have I, I, I have watched none of it. Okay, so we're fresh new. I do know like who like some of the rivals are because I do like watching a, a Yu YouTuber that does talk about it. So, okay, uh, I, I do I do know like you know this like the, like the girl is like the kind of like the girl ish rival. Yeah. So, Luke is our you know is the seven's rival. What is, is he the, like? What the, Luke's the main rival to, or is the rival to the main protagonist, or what? Or, or to Yuga? Uh, to Yuga, yeah. Okay. I'm assuming the chick is the, you know, the female protagonist. Yep, yep, she's the female protagonist. Always gotta have that one female protagonist. Hey, I'm just hey. saying, not getting a better female protagonist than the Kiza from 5Ds. Best one. Crazy. Psycho. <laughs> Could actually bring the cards to life? I mean... <laughs> they cry about it later. Then they cry about it later. She had major daddy issues. <laughs> Literally, if you look daddy issues up in the dictionary, she's probably the, like... Bam, right there. Daddy issues. Her daddy issues were so bad, she gained psychic powers. <laughs> okay, so, 
Uh, I, I know nothing about Sevens, so all these characters are brand, brand new to me. Um, so this is going to be uh, different. Because normally, like, with a Yu-Gi-Oh game, I have, a, you, know, like, you know, I have at least a good idea of, like, the characters and, like, the, the you know, how the story, f you know, flows, but... Mm -hmm. I, I think this game in general is just going to be weird for me because of the fact that it's, you know, it's a campaign Yu-Gi-Oh game that I haven't even seen. <laughs> And you know what? We're we're here for the dream together. So we're 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 uh, aiming to be the. I don't, I don't even know. I don't. Uh, so Do you know from like the trailer that you know it looks like there is dark magician, red eyes, blue eyes in this game? Okay. Uh, I, I've seen like like I said like I've seen like the first two episodes of seven. So like I kind of know like very small details, but enough to like. Like, like to point us a little bit in like a direction of going. I think I know who he is, and I have no idea who the hell that person is. <laughs> right. Um. Now, the only thing I think I've seen from Sevens is like the new card designs that they have, and they look so good. They do. They do look oh, good. Oh, what's that? Uh. Okay. So go wherever you like. Welcome to the world of Yu-Gi-Oh! Rush Duels Battle Royale, where here you can meet friends by battling in Rush Duels. You can run around. Oh, so it's open. Okay, that's cool. Uh, you can run around Goha City and talk to everyone you see to duel until you become the ultimate duelist. <laughs> I already am the ultimate duelist. <laughs> we shall duel everybody. Uh, uh, the character you see on the screen is you. Control your character with the left stick. Okay. Oh. Oh, my lord. Okay. Uh, okay. We're going to talk to the dude right here. All right. Our pants is the best. He plays in rugby matches, fixes the roof, and does everything. Cool. Uh, he doesn't want to duel. How weird. Uh, hey, what's up? Uh, what was this guy? You, Yuga? You, Yuga. Yuga? Talk. Hi. Keep talking to everybody. The ones with bubbles above their heads will give you new information before heading to downtown Goa. You should take a quick tour of the school and meet everybody. Uh, if you want to go to downtown Goa, plus the plus button. Uh, downtown Goa is too far to walk from school, so use the plus button to go there. All right, let's explore the school. Exploring. I love how we did that at the same time. Uh, if you want to go down to Russia, in that case, we are one. Get out of my brain. Uh, if you're lost, check the map on the top right. Okay. It looks like. Oh, I didn't. I didn't even see. I didn't even see the mini map at first. Oop. Oh, no, yeah, you, you got a mini map, and then if you hit your start button, it looks like it opens up a map. There are items. This is Pokemon. It's Pokemon. <laughs> Is it, wait, a Pokemon snag the You got a regular ticket. A regular ticket can be obtained. You can open card packs from the shop in the menu. Oh, uh, you can choose anywhere you go, but go hot city by pressing the plus button. Move there. You can see the information of the duelist encounter there. Um, now, give and give, uh, give, uh, keep in mind, the, this first episode is going to be a bit rough for quote unquote entertainment because we're still trying to figure out how to play this game. <laughs> okay, so, I mean, yeah, so this is yeah. how you. Okay, I see. So the yellow moves cursors. Um, we're gonna return. Uh, what was the button you said to uh, open up inventory? Um. Oh, it's Y. Apparently. Or yeah, it's X. My bad, it's X. Well, whatever it is on the switch. <laughs> yeah, X, Y, whatever. This is the other menu here. You can get special items by using promotional codes. You can check out the helper tutorial if you have any problems. Both of these features are jam packed with useful tips. Close. Okay. Seven's character info, help, credit. Oh, you can just straight up watch the credits now. <laughs> oh, good game. Yeah, that was fun. All right, so that seems like the only thing we can do is look at other. All right, now what's this? Ooh, seven road switches. That... Oh, okay, so we just went inside the school. Okay, here's that. What was your name again? Roman? Ramen? We're going to call her Roman. <laughs> Uh, it's school really must be like a maze, but you'll get used to it. Gavin should be in the student council office ahead. She should not be. All right, let's run to this classroom real quick. Oop, item! Tamed a regular ticket. You can, new, uh, you can open new card packs from the shop in the menu. Oh, that's just, I was like, is that a floating... They won't let us scroll over to the shop in the menu. <laughs> I want to get OP as fast as possible. It's not letting me in this doorway. Let me in the doorway! Let me pull... Well, just let me pull all the cards now. Well, let, let me get my full deck ready. What I didn't even what the hell did you just say? Our school's newspaper is great. Our school is one. Okay. 
I thought you said you're supposed to have good info. This is useless info. I don't need anything. Mm. This game's lying to me already, buddy. This game's lying to me already. Oh, yeah. You know, it, it, I, I feel like at some point it was going to do that. Might as well just start now. <laughs> might, as well, might as well just start now. Uh, you're not going to downhill. Go hub, but you need to earn the skills to serve in my court. Boy, I'm going to make you serve in the court. Because we're the kings around here. <laughs> Press the plus button to open the map to go to okay. I just want to go home. <laughs> I just want to duel somebody. I'm really like, uh, I aim to see how, oh god, oh my god, it just opened up. I will say, like, the open, quote-unquote, open world aspect of this feels pretty good so far. The camera, really? camera turns pretty fast, it makes me a little dizzy. <laughs> uh, dude, okay, so, I... I'm not going to talk to any more of the main characters because they just keep telling me to go downtown. But they told me to explore the school. Yeah. Can't be that girl says we can't do it. Yeah. <laughs> uh, if anyone cheats during a duel, Groha drones will report it security. Well, don't get caught cheating. Yeah. <laughs> beep, beep, check the license, follow the rules and duel. Okay. Follow the rules, don't cheat. Um, I don't know how I'm going to cheat, but we'll figure it out. Uh, I'm a pretty smart guy, I can figure it out. Oop, see, this is why we explore items. We got another ticket. Uh, Here we right. go. Uh, it looks like we can go, go to the downtown area, I guess. I, yeah, this looks like to be it. Well, alright, this is a nice school. Nice, it looks, you know, it looks pretty. Yeah, yeah pretty good so far. Alright, let's go to the downtown go high area. Now, oh, it just straight opened up. Uh, the Battle Royale hasn't started yet, but there are already tons of duels here. It's a little like about to get into a street fight. <laughs> it's about to be a street fight. Is this like a modern version of the uh, the Outriders? Uh, <laughs> yeah, something like that. Uh, this is like like a kid like kids version of Outriders. <laughs> All right. Let's do it, Pony Boy. Uh, let's do it, Pony Boy. Oh. Uh, uh, oh, I'm guessing red means fight. Ding ding. Uh, I, I, that's how I was always told. Number seven, student council vice president. Uh, blah, 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 blah. Be warned, I'm not I'm not known for going easy on my opponent. You must give 110 percent. That's. Ten percent more than a hundred percent. No, really. Because Rain will learn the basics of dueling. You don't need to learn. You know, it's it's weird because I think I was freaked out the same way. Oh. <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's ten more. That's ten percent more of a hundred. Let's duel. When the prepared duel screen appears, select basic deck one and press the A button. Get ready for the rush. Nice. I never met anyone who picked up the rules as quickly as you. You know how to rush them. You can get more deck recipes by doing various points. I never knew that. Spot all the cards in your deck. There's no rules against that. But since you're new to rush tools, you should gain more experience before building your own deck. I didn't want to build my own deck. Alright. Oh, no, no. You can now battle local duels by the menu by going to the connect the network match. Any opponents you face using this feature can become your rush friend. With even one rush friend, you can enjoy perks that are useful in game. Invite your friends to play rush duels together and become rush friends. Okay. Multiplayer. <laughs> uh, now you can set your duelist avatar from the menu by going to connect and then the match. When you obtain the duelist avatar, you can change your appearance during the network matches. You now use the Rush Friends feature in the menu. You can see all your Rush Friends you've made. Expand your Rush Friends circle with plenty of new members. Alright, Yuga, what you got for me there, Home Slice? You ready to duel? You ready to throw down, Jeeves? And you can keep that last deck. It's my gift to you. This deck is the first deck I've ever built when I started Rush Dueling. Oh, you can send a baby giraffe into the wild here where the little lions are. You need a paper, you need a papa dragon. 
boy. I am going to make you cry. So you could be the mama dragon. Okay, <laughs> I am not. <laughs> I'm not okay with this. <laughs> I'm not okay with this. Let's let the record let the let the record show. Let the record show. <laughs> not right. okay. Let's duel. Yeah, I'm gonna use Yuga's deck. Oh, oh. What? The, the, this this deck is, this um no not the deck but the uh this battle is hands off. They are looks like they're letting us do the beginning by ourselves. <laughs> oh okay. Run down paper out. This might be a true game. Oh yeah, no, I say we're starting at eight thousand, so we get to go second. Let's go. Dark Revelian, Spell Archer, Little Magical Sorcerer, and the Magical Sting. All right, let's do it. How did you get a better hand than me? <laughs> I don't know. Bro, I got it. I can actually get my cards. Let's go. I, I have a Wind Waker, a hat, and two trap cards. Oh. Uh, oh. Uh, part of the cards, I guess. <laughs> Unfortunate. Oh. Uh, okay, so that's cool. You can even you can set a card and still tribute it. Okay. I don't know what the point is, but I guess I'm not sure. Oh, okay, <laughs> I guess. I just... That's a lot of things that happen on that turn. Oh, animation. Could it be? It's the dragon again. Oh, so you can actually skip the animations. That's cool. I will say, um, uh, that was a very lot different uh, that happened to me than you. <laughs> Oh, why's that? Uh, she she just has the the firewall or the fire thing that had the cool looking art, and then she set one card face down and one card set and ended turn. Well, must be nice. So she brought out she brought out the dragon and then set one card. Set one card from the empty picture. I draw. Come on, hard the cards. Oh, that is not hard the cards. <laughs> Um, okay, let's look here. What do you do again? Destroy one. Okay, that's good. What do you do again? When your opponent. When an opponent's monster declares an attack, shuffle four spellcards to monsters from your graveyard into your deck. Destroy all. Oh. I have a feeling I'm supposed to let these cards die. <laughs> I don't know. Right, okay, let's set the card. Uh. Oh. Could bring that out, but it's still gonna die. And your effect? What do you do again? Uh, this turn, the, this card, if this card destroyed a monster by battle, it can make a second attack during that battle phase. Okay. So here's what we're gonna do. We are going to set two. Well, I guess we could set one. Yeah, we'll just go. Ahead, we'll just go ahead and set these two, and then pass. I, I believe in you. All right. I'll, I'll be button. Okay. End turn. Oh, was I not able? Okay. I end my turn. All right, I end my turn. Let's see how badly this duel's gonna go. <laughs> I believe in you. Part of the cards. Uh, so... I activate a spell card. What's that spell card? Uh, you have. A... Uh, yes, I would like to see details. You have a face up dragon type monster in your field. Destroy one spell trap card on the field. Naughty! <laughs> no! Not the trap. Not my trap card. That was my only saving grace. I should have just said I should just sent a card to the graveyard and got rid of it. Effect activated. This is about to hurt. <laughs> oh yeah, this is about to really suck. 
This is about to really suck. <laughs> <laughs> I think she's about to beat my booty. Oh, oh what this the what? This is not good. This is I'm watching your game. This is no, not good. No, no, <laughs> no, it's really not. The game went hard mode real quick. <laughs> See this? <laughs> it's like you don't want us to play around no more? Okay. <laughs> Uh, am I am I supposed to lose this game? Cause I feel I have a feeling that's where this is going. <laughs> Alright, so I'm gonna take 25 oh. points of damage. This is not good. <laughs> Here's a tune you're not gonna like. Okay. So uh, note to self: game goes hard mode really quick. <laughs> yeah. I can see that this this game does not uh does not care. <laughs> no, 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 it does not. All right. Uh, yeah. What do you mean I couldn't chain? Come on, heart of the cards, 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 heart of the cards. Let's do it. What the hell is that? Okay. Is it the heart of the cards? Is that what it looks like? <laughs> I set a card. Can I not activate this card? Yeah, you have to have a face up. Oh, you're a spellcaster, right? Oh, yes, you are. Hang on. I'll record myself this face up card from your field to the graveyard. One face up, level four, lower spellcast monster. Your field can attack directly this turn. Oh, that would be nice. When an opponent's monster declares an attack and you have a spellcaster type monster in your graveyard, attack monster loses five points. That, that would have been really nice last turn. <laughs> if you if you take forever, they start talking. Okay. And then, then they start talking crap. He's like, uh, uh, my, hold on. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm trying to figure things out. I'm, okay. I'm trying. To, I'm trying to do what Yu-Gi-Oh players don't do: read. Oh uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm trying to read here. All right, activate the spell card. Destroy their back row. Can I activate my face down card too? Or did I screw up already? Oh, I feel like, yeah, I can activate it. Activate that, get rid of your other spell card. Or your other back row card. And go cut a loop. Plug the plug. Alright, now we are going to summon Hugh. I tribute one monster. I tribute seven. We are going to set you, and I should be fine. Now we're going to go into battle phase, get rid of your monster. I attack with my monster. Okay, so I'm safe for one turn. <laughs> that is what I'm currently in the same boat. She didn't go as hard on, like... On me, but my draws are not saving me. Cause like, all right, let's duel. Training wheels completely off. You're going down a hill at 98 miles per hour. Let's duel. Like, what? <laughs> what the hell is this? All right, hop on your motorcycle. My what? <laughs> my, my, hmm? But I don't even know how to drive. Oh, figure it out. <laughs> gonna activate, activate your effect. I'm gonna pitch a card. No, I do not. Now attack me. Attack me! I summon a monster. No, I need that trip. And please don't please don't summon another one of those. Like that that'll be very bad for me. If she if she summons Okay. So if she summons another one of those things, I am screwed. <laughs> I guess you didn't let me read my trap card, so I'm just gonna put my trap card to it. Uh one face of monster Wait. One face up on your monster. Oh, yeah. This game's on hard mode. <laughs> Effect: One face-up monster. Your opponent, uh, your opponent's field loses 700 attack slash defense until the end of the turn. What? <laughs> this is baloney. <laughs> Zed, so this card's still gonna get go poof. Let's battle. 
I'm gonna activate Everybody it. Done? I'm still I'm gonna activate it anyways. Activate it so that way I don't take as much damage because <laughs> I'm in danger. <laughs> you too. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I'm looking at. That's nothing. I wonder. I wonder if you're supposed to lose this duel. I don't know. Oh, I lose. Uh, I hundred percent lose here. Okay. Yep, I lose. <laughs> I, 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 I feel like you're supposed to lose. At least that's what I'm telling myself. <laughs> well, that's, well, that's what I'm telling myself. I gained one uh, card. I gained one card. Well, so far, I mean. Oh no, you're not supposed to lose. I don't know what she's. They say they told me to retry. Okay. Yeah, whole time the game doesn't go hard mode on you this time. It went like X Games mode, bro. Jesus. That's solid. Okay, I am gonna go second. God Almighty. Okay, I. I... Yeah, I got a bit of a better hand this time. Is all. That's good. Not 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 well. too not too much better, but it's, it's looking better. I swear to God, if she if, if this if she pulls that monster out first turn again, this game hates me. A little bit. <laughs> I won't lie. I won't lie. I haven't seen it once. I'm I'm kind of happy for myself. <laughs> Must be nice. What's she bringing out? She's bringing out the sun, the gravity press dragon, which I believe, yes. Yeah, no, like, okay, so I had, I had the save, and then she brought out this gravity press dragon. It's like, oh, you have a little hope? No! <laughs> no hope for you. Like, okay. I mean, I, like, I was in a, I was in a bad place, <laughs> but, like, I, I played it on a trap card that I couldn't read. I was like, all right, I don't remember what this, this card does. Let me read it. And the game's like, all right, you want to play the card? I was like, but I was just, I was, I was trying to... <laughs> Bro, bro, bro. Oh no. oh no. Bro, this game hates me. You can play through it, I believe it. Do. I don't. Oh god, this game absolutely hates me. Uh, okay, sit so right here. You draw seven drill magician. I, I, I better. It's the only way I'm gonna destroy that card. Alright, I draw. Nope, Hydro Magician. Uh you have any effects? I have the, I have the shaman which I can attack directly. Huh. One face level four cancer contender. Yeah. I say I can take I can deal it I can deal her eleven hundred points of damage. Okay, so here's what I'm gonna do. I am going to... set three hope for the best. <laughs> no, I'm uh, I'm I'm going I'm gonna set two. Oh. She got out her dragon against me. Well, I wasn't looking. Okay, so I'm gonna set this. I'll set a monster. I'm gonna set that. Summon this. No. That way I can attack that face down card, and then we are going to set two. I I was in the victory slot. Mm -hmm. Uh, then she played a card to destroy my trap card. <laughs> oh, nice. I don't I don't know where this. This is this isn't good for anybody. Yeah. <laughs> Remember, she already beat me once. Like, I. Uh... Battle. Alright, we're gonna do, do attack that face down card you have. Okay. Destroyed. 
And hopefully on the next on uh, on my next turn, hopefully I can draw into that magician. <laughs> I'm ending my turn. The god can come. Yeah. Oh please, oh Egyptian gods. <laughs> Obelisk. I summon Obelisk the Dormantor. Yeah, this you're gonna attack me. Oh, I don't want to see it. No, I don't need to see the details. I summon a monster. No, I don't need to see the details. Sets a card. Game one, X game mode. So that's another card. Okay. Just gonna attack with that. I'm attacking my face down card. Oh. Some of these monsters that we have that like have effects are not once per turn. Or or like so like if you have like another copy of the card, mm -hmm. it seems like they allow you to like activate the effect again. Oh really? I'm only. I'm only. I'm, I'm, I, I minimize my damage in that first. That first assault. So I will say I need to draw. I need to get some cards. You're down one. I will say if I don't get anything here, I lose. Because <laughs> that is a very frightening back row. Seven row position. Let's go. What you did? Someone spellcast your monster from your hand to the graveyard, draw a card. Basically, I did like just draw an extra card. But that was actually the card that I was using to actually get multiple cards of. Uh, send one card from your hand to the graveyard, change the opposition of one monster on your opponent's field. Detect the ship comes, please. Okay. Uh, okay, so. Yeah, what's this again? Four monster, okay. So we're going to summon this. Yeah, activate its effect. Do I have to send a send one spell catch to that monster? Okay, I don't know if I'm gonna do that just yet. Uh, what is it? What do you do? What do you do for the top card of your deck to the graveyard? This card gains attack equal to the number of different attributes of in your graveyard times three hundred. Okay. So we will go ahead and summon. Ease. No, we're gonna summon you first. Summon a monster. Then we're going to summon you. I pop in you to the graveyard. Send one card from your hand to the graveyard. Okay. So we're going to activate your effect. That was a hard fight. <laughs> okay. So we're going to send my trap card. Send my trap card to the graveyard. We're going to change this card to defense position. I switch this monster to defense position. I'm going to summon Hugh. Sure. You two. Seven road magician. The embodiment of my heart. The embody of my heart. Okay, we're going activate to the effect. Activate the effect. Pitch a card. 3,300. Now, is it only... Does it only stay one turn? Um, I think so. So you might want to attack the big monster. Uh, this is the top card. The number. This card needs attack equal to the number. Until the end of the turn, okay. Yep. 
the hell out of here. Go, Seven's Road Magician. Seven's Be gone with you. I think she only has that. I think that's like her strongest monster, though. So I, I don't think she has multiple. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm just gonna say I hope she has that multiple. I will say though, there is one card. Uh, one card. I hope she only has one of as well that decreases my attack or decreases attack of one of my monsters by 700. If that happens, seven seven's magician is dead. <laughs> okay, so she has three monsters. What is she gonna do? Oh, activate monster effect. Uh, I think this is. I think this adds a dragon, right? Oh, it adds it back from the graveyard. No. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Meg, what the? Why is this game on X Games mode? <laughs> Bro, what the hell? Why is this game on X Games mode? Bro, I don't know. <laughs> this is very not good. Can, can I activate my. Can I activate this ability now? <laughs> Oh god. Yeah, that's cool. Cool, cool story, bro. Cool story, bro. Cool story, bro. Uh. Does have another one? It does have another one. Mhm. Mm no, the 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 one the monster that causes oh. my attack by seven hundred. That's nothing. The question is, can the attack only? Okay. No. Okay. And that's gay. Right. Next game. <laughs> <laughs> Will I be able to beat her?
Let's go! See, if she didn't bring the dragon, I wouldn't have been an issue! The fact that she brought out the dragon both duels first turn, game hates me. <laughs> God! Oh. Oh, it's over with. Oh, now we have the we have the multi strike dragon and the, the Gabby Press. Nice. Yeah, we get the deck. With that, uh, with that episode in the books, that was uh, it was a bit annoying. Girl, we're definitely on next games mode. <laughs> oh, my I God. cannot wait for the next challenges of the head in our next and second episode all right tune in next week for the next episode hope you see you guys there and uh... thank you guys so much for tuning into this video if you haven't yet make sure you like the video comment down below and hey subscribe it's free helps us out you guys get notified when we upload all of the juiciest content to the youtube and uh that's it for now we'll see you next week peace